What do you suggest? The Boston 12 or uh, the Adios Pro uh, version 3? Let's check it out. Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome back to the channel. Uh, today we are diving into a uh, head-to-head uh, showdown uh, between the uh, two different models, the Boston 12 and the Adios Pro 3. I've been getting a tons of questions about these two models. Uh, therefore, if you want to know all the details, including the running dynamics, check out my full uh, review videos uh, up here. Now let's lace up and uh, get started. First up, let's hit uh, the specs. Uh, both shoes uh, have the same drop, uh, but the Adios Pro 3 has a nice stack height uh, and uh, it's lighter. Why? Because the Pro 3 is uh, all about uh, uh, light strike pro form, while the Boston 12 uh, combines light strike pro to the uh, light strike 2.0. The Pro 3 also sports the carbon uh, energy rods, uh, making it uh, fancy but also more uh, uh, expensive and you will feel it in your wallet too. Uh, 250 euro uh, versus 160 euro in Europe uh, for the Boston 12. Also, now. now let's talk about the also uh, the, the Adios Pro 3 uh, and Boston 12 have different uh, design patterns, uh, especially up front, uh, but share the same continental rubber. Initially, I thought the Pro 3 uh, would be a slip and slide adventure, but now it is very grippy and uh, maybe even better than the Boston 12 uh, on dry roads. I've looked over uh, another 60 miles uh, in the Pro 3 and um, around another 10 uh, in the Boston 12 and uh, both are holding up great. Uh, that continental rubber is not a joke. Plus, the Pro 3 shows you don't uh, need tons of rubber uh, to get good grip uh, and uh, durability. Who knew less could be more? Midsole now. On the midsoles, the Boston 12 uh, features both Light Strike Pro and uh, 2.0, as we said, while the Pro uh, sticks uh, um, to just Light Strike Pro, uh, giving it a bouncier and lighter feel. The Pro is more responsive, uh, which means uh, a quicker response time and a more vertical bounce. Great for racing, uh, but maybe not as efficient for some runners. The Boston 12 is a little bit too sluggish, and the foot for me too. The Pro has a higher uh, stack height and uh, more form, uh, making it uh, more comfy, and uh, especially on the long runs. The Boston 12 uh, use the glass uh, fiber infused energy roads, uh, while the Pro 3 uh, is full carbon, offering a smoother transition from uh, heel to toe. The Pro 3 rocker's shape uh, also helps uh, uh, with those move uh, transition because as you can see is higher stability wise both shoes hold the ground upper now the uppers totally different the pro fits uh, through two sides the boston 12 uh, might need uh, enough sides down both are breathable but the top box on the Boston 12 uh, is a bit too loose for my liking. If you have got a slim forefoot uh, like me, uh, this can be a deal breaker, especially during tempo runs. The lacing systems are also a mixed bag. Um, the Pro 3 has uh, rings that could potentially uh, rip, uh, even if uh, I haven't yet. The Boston 12 system is a bit heavy and uh, complicated. I'm all for this important. Durability-wise, both uppers are uh, doing well. The Boston 12 uh, uh, is a big improvement uh, uh, over the Boston 11, uh, which was uh, rip first. Tanks are similar and uh, functional, and the heel counters uh, are comfy and secure, with the Pro taking the edge for best in the lineup. Aesthetically speaking, I'm leaning towards uh, the Adios Pro 3, but both are stylish and uh, their own right. And in conclusion, guys, as you can see from my scores, uh, you already understood 
that um, are leaning more towards the Adios Pro 3. The Adios Pro 3 takes uh, the crown. Uh, it is more expensive, uh, fits better, and uh, it's overall a uh, surprise, a show, uh, except maybe on the uh, gravel path. For training, uh, the Boston 12 might be uh, better, uh, bet for long runs uh, uh, to save the uh, Pro 3 uh, for race day. The Pro 3 is versatile enough for various distances and definitely uh, worth the extra cash. Hope you find this review useful. If you did, please uh, smash the like button and uh, hit subscribe. Uh, it's just one click for you, but uh, a huge support for me and for my channel. As always, thanks for watching. Until the next time. Keep running. <clears throat> Ice in my veins, I've been driving this train. Years in this lane, there's no stopping this flame. Cause I came to the game and I changed it to play. How I like rearranged it to my own domain. Yeah, I got what it takes. Made lots of mistakes. Taking shots, skipping breaks. Feeling lost, feeling great. Popping off, singing straight. Never stop, never changed. All the squad here to play. And I've got something to say, yeah. I work hard each and every day. I get lost in the words I say. I don't push pause, no, I push play. I won't stop till I make a change I withdraw on the things I make I turn flaws into flawless traits I build tall, never cap in space I won't stop till I hear him say I